besties, welcome back to another Star Stable video. Today, we have something pretty exciting. Since the winter update is upcoming, I'm going to share with you some tips and tricks to save up star coins and get a lot of star coins before the winter season. I tried to be a bit more creative with these so you get like different ideas that you might want to try out and like switch back and forth or try more than one. It's really up to you. So let's get into it then. And if you want more, let me know in the comments down below. But there are so many sets we need to save up for and new horses so let's go My first tip is to create a horse wish list or an item wish list ahead of time. You can do this by checking out some spoiler videos. If you don't want to be spoiled though and want to have the updates when they come out, you could just set yourself like a goal price max if that makes sense. Like, oh, for the winter update, I only want to spend 500 star coins on tops and 250 on maybe a brand new saddle, you know, just limit yourself like that so you can kind of have it planned out before and that way you know how much you have and how much you need or how much you want to need. So um, that made no sense, but you know, you kind of have it organized and you can also do this with horses already in game, like if you want an Arabian or a Perdron, anything like that, you could put those on your wish list. But this also goes for a seasonal little take, if you know what I mean. And you could save up for seasonal items that might not be coming back and create yourself a unique wish list with just the seasonal items, since those are limited time and you probably feel more inclined to buy seasonal items since you know they won't be coming back for another 365 days. So yes, that is my tip number one on saving stars coins. Tip number two on saving star coins is to look for any upcoming horse discounts. Now you could see them like the day they're posted on a uh, Star Stable news website. They announce like in the update if they discounted any horses. But here on my channel, I also post whenever there's a horse discount, what horse will be discounted and kind of the overall time of when it will be discounted, like a week away, a month away, anything like that. But definitely plan for horse discounts Send the, since they can be super helpful, especially we just had the Black Friday sale and the horses prices were halved. So that was so exciting. I was so happy to check that out. But Star Stable usually just horse discounts, I'd say once per month. So definitely have your eyes peeled for those and plan ahead if like you want the Tennessee Walker and it's getting discounted. I would wait so you can buy two or even just save your star coins instead of just going right away and buying it. Next is to train your horses before buying another horse or kind of like to reward yourself when something, you know, like, okay, say you were studying for this really big test and you're like, okay, if I get an A, then I can buy the horse, you know, you can do that. Or if you finish training like two of your horses, then you could buy one to kind of even it out a little bit more, you know, set yourself goals so that you just don't spend star coins every single day, unless you want to, of course, bestie, and you can, but setting yourself goals can be pretty helpful and then it makes it even more rewarding 
rewarding to buy horses or if you're saving up for an item even you could do this for an item as well like you really want the new saddle pad that just came out then you could set yourself a goal maybe a smaller goal than a horse but you know like oh if I do this for a week do my homework on time for a week or something then I could buy myself the saddle pad you know like just come up with creative ways to set yourself and give yourself a little reward because you deserve it bestie you know Next, do activities like questing or training, making outfits with the items you already have, and log into Star Stable without the intention of spending star coins. Even if you only spend like 150 star coins a day because maybe you are a pack or something like that, then um, it does add up in the long run. So I do recommend try, if you're like really inclined to buy stuff in shop, try to do things and distract yourself from the shop. I would say make outfits but you always find that perfect item for your outfit in global shops or like I might as well buy it but you know just try to do things other than that and even if you complete the quest line and then you want to give yourself a little treat or a reward of buying a horse then go ahead you know just do it like that Next, I've heard this work for some people, but put a tape over your how much money you have in star coins. This can also work for your big shillings if you want to save it up. But I would just put a tape over that because then you won't you don't see it. So you're like, oh, I must have no star coins. I don't know. It works though. It surprisingly works really well. So you can put tape over your screen. Just don't accidentally open global store or have tape there already. You know, just put it on your monitor or your computer screen or even your phone. You could do this on your phone as well and hide your star coins amount. Bye everyone, thank you so much. That was really loud. Bye everyone, thank you so much for watching the Star Stable video. As always, have a great day. Thank you so much for watching and uh, let me know which one of these was most helpful to you in the comments down below. Or if you have any more tips and tricks, I'd like to know. Let me know in the comments down below as well. Bye bye. Oh yeah, I currently have a free 10,000 star coin giveaway up on my channel. Definitely go check that out if you haven't already.